a political stunner. The longtime attorney general of Illinois announces she won't run for re-election. Here's Lisa Madigan taking the oath of office back in 2015. Today, her bombshell that she won't be taking the oath again in 2019. That is fueling speculation of a Lisa Madigan, Rahm Emanuel showdown for mayor. CBS2 political reporter Derek Blakely picks up the story. The announcement, a political thunderbolt. Lisa Madigan closing out her 16-year run as attorney general, but not necessarily closing the door on politics. Madigan telling WBBM Radio. Look, at the end of my term, it'll be 16 years as attorney general, and uh, I'm ready for new challenges. I'm ready uh, to, you know, use my skills in a different way to continue to help people. I present... The Civilian Office of Police Accountability. As he unveiled the city's new police oversight agency, COPA, Mayor Emanuel praised Madigan's tenure. She has fought uh, for a set of values and ideals that I share. But Madigan's also fought the city on policing, suing to force court enforcement of police reform, a move Emanuel first opposed and later endorsed. Is she someone that could pose a challenge to Mayor Emanuel? She chooses to do that. I would consider her a formidable candidate, yes. But Madigan herself, vague on her future plans. I do not know what the future holds politically, but at this point, I'm not seeking re-election as attorney general, and I have no immediate plans to run for any other office. And with Madigan out, the race to replace is already on. I think everyone's going to look to uh, Sheriff Tom Dart. Um, he's obviously got a law enforcement background and has experience. Also considering a run, State Senator Kwame Raoul and McHenry County Board Chairman Jack Franks. Another effect of Madigan's move, it immediately makes the candidacy of the expected Republican nominee, former Miss America Erica Harold, a lot more viable now that a popular incumbent is out of the picture. Robin Erica? So she's not running for anything, but if she were to run for mayor, she's got to crank this up pretty soon if she makes that decision. Well, the race is still a bit away, but uh, she says again that she hasn't made any plans for the moment. So for the moment, we take her at her word. Okay, Derek, thank you.